All right, real quick. I don't know if you maybe you'll only listen to this tomorrow, but th- th- this is an absolute truth, right? You wanted a point. You wanted a point. So, and it should be a strong point, and it should be a true point. And and what that is is this: if the if the the hardest the hardest part by far of my life's work is not already done. Like then, then, then we have fucking destroyed one of your sons. Like that's the point. Like if 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 I haven't done amazing work and found like crazy viable ideas, I'm fucked because I'm insane. Like and you don't trust me because I haven't built anything because I have not been able to afford to. Except after like almost being dead, and then except after losing mom right when I had a baby and like the only way I was going to ever have a baby was like that what was then was was with Tia should I should I actually have no children because you are worried that I might never make anything of myself the point is I've already made something amazing of myself and no I don't have a lot of cash right now I'm afraid of it right you have three I think you have 300 times as much money as I do. And I would say that our, 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 if you say, what's your internet worth? Like everything you have plus everything inside your mind examined after like a period of the next 25 years. Like I'd say I have 300 times inside my mind what you have in cash and assets. Like your net worth. I'd say I probably, let's so you'd say your net worth is 3 million. That's a guess. I hope you have 3 million. Like, so uh, that would only be 900 million dollars 300 times what you actually have so you have 900 million if i'm not worth 900 million i have fucked up severely it doesn't mean i'm gonna fail in this world but if i'm not if what's in my head if if, if the ideas that i've mined with my mind out of my mind for 25 years are not worth 900 million dollars like i fucked up drastically right so that's 900 million one three hundredth of that is three million dollars which i hope you have right and then, and then one three hundredth of that is what I have. And I love you and I appreciate you not just like raising me in the way I was raised and letting mom raise me in the way mom raised me and then just like letting me possibly die because of it. Like I do appreciate that, but I have maybe 10 G's. I hope you have 310 G's and, um... I, I would pray if I believed in God that, that the work I've done already is worth $900 million. Keep in mind, I'm childish, but I'm relatively brilliant, right? I'm relatively ingenious, at least. I'm, like, I got a 139 on an IQ test on a day when I, when I was very, very fucking depressed. Um, and I've essentially only been depressed when people were like shitty to me. Like, yeah, it could be women who are just like, kind of like fuck you. Like, I don't like you. Like, you're too... Like, whatever, it's like, it's not me. I'm like, I'm a fucking good, open, honest, loving human being. Like, my, my mom and my dad, they made me that way and gave me enough positive reinforcement. Like, that, that's how I am, but that doesn't work. Like, it doesn't work with you people. Not that they're bad, like, and it's not their fault. Just like it's really not mine, and it's probably not yours, and it's not dicks. And, and, but it's also not, like, well, if it's anybody's fault, it's, it's God's fault. Obviously, like, God would have to be the original sinner. So, if, I, if the hard part of my life's work isn't already done, I am completely fucked. My jaw is fucked up. I'm going to need, like, major fucking medical intervention over the next couple decades. Like, major fucking medical intervention. I'm going to need a ton of fucking help. Like, I got, I've done nothing with my children. Like, they, they live in a room together, which is, it's not refugee shit, right? But, like, it's, whatever, it's actually fine at the moment. But they've never seen the ocean They've never been on a horse. Like, whatever, I was... A lot of kids don't go on horses. Um, We've never really taken a vacation except to your house, which is, like, amazing. Thank fucking God. But part of the reason maybe that it's not a big deal and that I don't have to take a vacation is because you have, like, a lake, little mini lake mansion paradise spot. So, I mean, at least there is that. They do have that. And, like, you buy them some nice things. and, And that kind of helps. They get some things, even though I don't have shit. So if I've been working for 25 years, if it's not worth, it doesn't have to be worth 900 million, right? But it's got to be worth at least what you're worth, right? It's not worth 10 grand. It's not worth what I'm worth, right? And it's not worth, maybe it's not worth 900 million. It could be worth 900 billion. 
what I've done in 25 years could be the underlying intellectual equity and power that results in a corporation that eventually is uh, of, of, the, of uh, uh, the size that Amazon reached and, and uh, Apple reached and uh, Tesla reached, like a fucking trillion dollars. But it doesn't have to be worth 900 million, but it has to be worth 3 million. Like, and it certainly has to be worth enough to like cover helping Tia with like 20 grand and buying a p- little piece of land uh, for 30 and maybe literally just building a non-permanent tiny house in the fucking short term, like, like whatever it is. Like I work on shit here in, in my space, but it's all essentially garbage. I have like one of the worst DeWalt drills in, 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 in modern history. And that's, that's it in terms of like, I have three wrenches, a DeWalt drill, zip ties. I wanted you to come in Discord because the last conversation we had was good. But then you had to go and talk to somebody else right in the middle of it. You're just like, boom, gone. And then that's it for like days and days and days. and like Months, I think, we went and didn't even, didn't even talk. But like, you are the one that ended that conversation and walked away. And it was good. It's not about, again, it's not about blame, but that is what happened. And <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to just call and bother you constantly. You'll go fucking crazy. Like, I think you can barely do what you do in terms of, of listening. And in and, and part because you don't, like, look up to me. Like, if you look at, if we stand in a mirror and look at one another, you're going to think you've done way more than me. Like, you've done way more than me. You've earned way more than me. Like, and everything you've done, and what have I done? Or, like, use my mind. Now, yes, yeah, true. Most of the money you made uh, at Valen was using your mind, you know, not your body. So that's not really a... Uh, a great argument and if in fact i've done something super worthwhile without anybody believing it like it's a huge fucking accomplishment it's an amazing thing right it's an amazing amazing thing and actually have done that and and the hardest part of my life's work by far is done and if it's not i'm gonna fucking have to kill myself because i'm gonna end up in so much pain that there's no other way out my, if my jaw hurt three times worse i'd like for like a week i would have to kill myself I've, I've been left with freedom under 100% stress. How do I survive? I, I rush shit. I rush that energy through my fucking head like a jet because the higher speed, like a, if stress is like a, like a, a, a gas and a pressure, the, the faster it goes, the lower the, the pressure. That's why when Ayrton Senna's Formula One car bottomed out, too much, like it, 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 it took air that was going under the car at like 100 fucking 90 kilometers per hour and stopped it because the, the belly of the car completely flattened and it went from incredibly high speed to zero speed while lifting the, the tires slightly off the, the tarmac. So the tires were losing their grip, and the, and the body of the car, instead of being sucked down to the ground, um, was not, it was, it was, just sli- it was just sliding, and the car was going fast as shit, and it's light as fuck, and then he died. It's, a pre- it's just the pressure. Like, I stress, I... I'm 100% stressed out all the time. I just vent it constantly, but it's gonna, it will kill me. Like, I'm in pain and, and I realize I've gone too far, but like, I've been waiting all this time. Like, one of these days, like, I gotta, like, if I just work like amazingly year after year, one of these days, my father will add it up and be like, okay, well, I mean, you've, you've, you've worked for 64,000 hours. So, you know, I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna invest $1 per hour that you've worked to help you drastically for the first time. And I know that's less than the money, I, you know, we spent on the NSX and I know it's less than, you know, your mother left you, but, and it would be, it would be like, <laughs> if you offered me the same amount, it wouldn't be half, but it would be like two times, if you just, if you just blend in average numbers, right, two times, um, both of which, like, <laughs> I mean, yes, mom dying is fucking horrible. Like, dying way too fucking young. I don't, I don't, I mean, I don't know how exactly how much mom, like, suffered. I don't think, like, she suffered a great deal. I mean, other than just, like, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be gone and I don't want to fucking leave. (sighs) 
I don't even remember the fucking point. Like, why am I talking about... Oh. Like, I want, like, you know, to build... Like, what, what, what would the plan be? It's probably going to be the same thing. The plan will be to build a, a, a garage. Right? It would be to build a garage. Not a garage, a garage. It would be to build a garage apartment, a car, a carriage house. Speaking ironically, um, because I mean, cars are not... I mean, they're fun. They're more fun than they are a great method of, of economical transportation. I mean, very convenient... And very, and very fun, like, versus a train. A train will probably get pretty boring. Um, I mean, they're actually very convenient for long-range, long-distance trips. But, I mean, if we're spending... It's just, it's fucking crazy. Like, whether it's you or me, if we're spending $1,200 a month <coughs> just on rent... And you figure, you don't really want me to have to, like, get poorer and poorer and poorer moving forward, right? Like, going to a smaller place and then a smaller place and pretty soon be homeless. But listen, at least we could maintain the level and then for now you're paying for it. But if, if, if we worked together correctly, that same $1,200 would go towards a house of, uh, you know, what value? Probably... Twelve hundred dollars a month. I mean, I'm thinking that gets you like you could probably get a two hundred thousand uh, dollar loan on twelve hundred dollars a month. And and yeah, you, you, like the thing is, of course, yeah, you got to pay for that. But we're already paying twelve hundred a month, right? So the twelve hundred a month, we could just keep paying. We'd just be paying. Uh, for a piece of land, which is not going to drastically depreciate. I mean, the, the prices are pretty high, so it's not like you can count on making money from land. But in a town like Kemo, where some people without a ton of money do like to live, and where there are some decent houses, like, and families do like to show off a little bit, like building uh, a garage house there, building a place that, like, if I succeed, obviously I would always, always keep. And I guess there's a scenario where, like, if I, if I were to fail, um, I mean, I can't, I really cannot imagine a scenario where we would build a house and then sell it. If we built a house that was good enough to sell, we wouldn't have to sell it. Like, 